One week after a speeding car nearly crashed into a crowd of people, Winter Garden safely held its annual Christmas parade tonight. Good evening and welcome. I'm Christy Kern. And I'm David Bowden. This was the scene last week after that car nearly hit a police officer before crashing into another vehicle near the parade route. As Fox 35 Stephanie Buffalmonte reports, that incident didn't stop people from spreading some Christmas cheer. Winter Garden Police made some changes as a safety precaution this week. Last week, officers closed the roads as the parade moved along. This week, the roads downtown were closed hours before the parade even started. The rescheduled Winter Garden Golf Cart Christmas Parade went off without a hitch Sunday. I find it crazy, you know, there was Olaf and stuff like that. About 200 golf carts drove through Winter Garden to spread holiday cheer. The parade was canceled abruptly last week when a car sped past the crowd downtown. Police say the driver crashed into another car. It happened minutes after the parade started, but the golf carts hadn't reached downtown yet. Brandon Bayless says their cart was stopped shortly after they got moving. The kids really enjoyed the five minutes that we got to do last week, so we figured we had we had to come back out this week. I'm glad they rescheduled. No one in the parade crowd was hurt. Yes, it was scary, but we're we're moving past that. People riding their golf carts say this do over is a sign of community strength. Disappointing for all the families who are on Plant Street that witnessed everything, but um, that's a Winter Garden spirit. Get together and do it again. Police closed the streets downtown four hours before the parade started. A new safety precaution put in place this week. Many parade goers say it makes them feel safer. When we were down here last week getting set up and the kids were kind of hanging out by the curb, we had to really make sure they were off the street and now everybody can just kind of not worry about it as much. And for many in the crowd today, they were excited to be back kicking off Christmas week and were full of holiday spirit. Just being with family and stuff and seeing the lights, you know, it brings all of us together. Organizers say they were happy to be able to put this back on. They say the money raised at this event goes to various organizations in the community. Reporting in Winter Garden, Stephanie Buffmonte, Fox 35 News.